Subscribe to Cookie the Main in the next 5 seconds and you'll get infinite luck and hatch 100 secret pets. I know I'm subscribing. Alright guys, we have a brand new world update. So you know what that means. We have to go ahead and hatch 100,000 eggs of this brand new egg over here. So uh, yeah, let's go ahead and start hatching. Alright guys, and just like that, we hatched 24 hours. Not really 24 hours, but we did hatch 100,000 of the brand new uh what do you call this egg the pastel egg which we actually got every single pet in it but i don't know if it had a uh, secret pet or not and this egg is very limited so anything we hatch in here is not going to be here anymore until the new egg here comes like for the next update or so so then yeah let's go and see what we hatched i mean obviously we did hatch everything here so hopefully we did hatch some shinies and stuff but we did finally hit two million uh eggs right there so that's pretty cool not gonna lie all right, so let's go over to items, pets. Uh, let me unequip all my pets. I think everything's unequipped. Let's go by world. So, yeah, we got a plenty of new tier three. So we have, uh, seems like 11 because there's five each row, 5, 10, 11. So we can make about two shinies of those. So that's pretty good for our team, I guess. And then I'm guessing this is the uh, tier, tier two. We have plenty of these, yeah give a good amount and then we have some sky unicorns which is a tier one so we didn't really hatch much of the sky unicorn and all the other stuff as you see we didn't hatch much but we did hatch some shinies which is pretty cool uh neon Sp spore light we did hatch two shiny and then for the pastel hexarium we did just hatch 11 so that's l but let's go ahead and see yeah we didn't we didn't have to see her pet we just saw but let's go ahead and see what it is into the pet index right here. What do we get? Uh, let's see. What do we get for a reward? Two hours. Okay, so they definitely did better than the previous egg right here. 2022 egg, which only got like 30 minutes. Not even like 30,000 gems. Like no one literally wanted that, honestly. But I guess we can. We have to deal with it. But really quickly, let's see what the regular these pets look like before we go ahead and make them shiny and all that. So, yeah. All right, so pastel hexarium, and then we have the sky unicorn, which I think I did show in the previous video of um, like a brand new update, all that. If you guys haven't seen that, but look at this! Wow, the neon spar spore light is pretty, pretty good looking. I'm not gonna lie, and then we have the sky unicorn. It, it's a basic unicorn with some some clouds around it, and then we have the pastel hexarium, which has some cat ears on it, which is kind of confusing to me. And it has a tail and some wings. So there we go. That's how those pet looks like. And so let's unequip those. And let's go all the way back to the main world. So we can make these all shiny and all that. All right. I'm sad we didn't get a secret pet, but I mean, there's no, there was no uh, way I was gonna hatch that. That was like one in four million. So yeah. And, all right. So where are the pets at? Wow, they're all the way at the bottom. Oh no, no, no. they're right here. All right, we have a lot of these. And good thing when we were grinding for the enchant, like enchants on the uh, the new tool, we got like two thousand fire shards from just grinding the. Uh, I don't know what that last world in the spawn world right here is. This crystal cavern, we literally like AFK that for hours, and I got tons of ores. Obviously, like enchant my tool, but we also got a ton of fire shards, so that's pretty cool. Also, they're not going down, confusingly. Uh, anyways. Let's make these pastel hexariums shiny. All right. That should be all the ones we can make. Yeah, if we had one more, we'd be able to do that. And just to show what it looks like shiny, I'll do that. Just for the index. I'm really honestly going to delete those because they're not really like powerful enough for me. Uh, I did all these. So, yeah, let's look what these look like shiny. Uh, sky unicorn. Ooh, we didn't have much shiny unicorns. I, I lied. As soon as I said that, a whole bunch of them just spawned in. Wow. All right, and then the pastel hexarium. Let's see what that looks like. Ooh, I like that. It looks kind of cool. All right, so yeah, they, I definitely like this one a lot more. It has like a pinkish gradient, like, you know, I don't know how to explain it, but it has like a pinkish gradient to it. The tail is like yellowish, uh, pinkish, and it has some pink smoke around it. It kind of matches the uh, new tool we have here. And then we have the neon spore light. It literally looks like a, a, a mango, mango, like a mango pineapple. I don't know honestly what you're going to call it. And then we have this ugly, toxic-looking sky unicorn. I don't know, uh, honestly, why, but yeah. All right, so let's do our prizes in the index. Hopefully, it's something good. Because if it's not, I'm gonna be sad, honestly. Come on, let's see. All I have to scroll all the way down. Wow. All right, here we are. Past all leg. Let's see what we get. Two hours of boost. Okay, I, I guess I'll take that. That's an extra two hours of boost we could use. So yeah, that's literally what the pets look like. So. 
I'm gonna go ahead and wait. Can I have like a full team of these? Because if I have a full team of shiny uh, pastel Paraxariums and neon spore lights, then that would be good because we don't have to get shiny sky unicorns on my team because I don't like those. But yeah, this is basically gonna be like our stat team for uh, the the crystal world, I guess, until we have some new stuff. Uh, what just happened? Oh, I cooked the best by accident. Oh my god, I have to equip these all over again. I don't know why that button is like right there, right next to the equip button when I the pets are like down here. I don't know if we, really, I don't know, it doesn't really make any sense, but yeah. All right, we need ten of these, so it's ten of these neon spore lights and two pastel hexariums. So we can find those somewhere around here. Here they are. All right. So now this is literally our team. It's just a bunch of orange and pastel pets. Let me turn this off, so it doesn't really bother me. And let's go all the way to Mystic Forest so we can literally level these up in seconds because they're legendaries. And legendaries don't take that long to like uh, level up. So yeah. Uh, I was gonna collect that chest really quickly, but I, it's gonna be stupid because I can just do that later after my pets are leveled up and they have some good stats. But yeah, let me see. Yeah, they're literally at level eight already. So let me just really quickly do this. And oh, we have some ores up here. Wow, that's cool. We got some more ores here, more ores. Wow, but we did hatch a lot of good stuff out of those 100,000 eggs. I'm not, not, I mean, like, a secret pet is not guaranteed within 100,000 eggs. Because there's, like, millions of chances, like, 1 in 4 million and, like, 1 in 100 million chances. But it would have been cool if I did actually hatch that. Because there has been times where I've hatched secret pets within, like, 24 hours of the update being out. Which is pretty sick, but it's not always going to happen every time. It's just pure luck. And I'm not really that lucky, if you want to see but oh we're really close with the level up but yeah uh hopefully the next egg that comes out it does uh allow me to hatch a secret pet i'll definitely be hatching that egg a lot more often and hopefully get a secret pet but i feel like the tier threes and uh tier twos are definitely good enough for me for stat wise and getting like all these uh currencies because i definitely like didn't have like any secret pets at all during the shells uh what do you call it not shells uh atlantis world and i did like i have like a like two quadrillion of those and that's literally what I use. I use those to make gems in the factory, which you guys all see me like every Money Simulator 2 video I do. And it's basically a free way for me to make some gems whenever like those eggs come out or I buy boost from the shop. But yeah, uh, I think all the pets are uh, finally leveled up. But yeah, let's go ahead and check the stats on them. So for the shiny pastel hexaria, it's 167,000 coin multiplier, 160,000 mining multiplier. Uh, 18.5 thousand crystal multiplier, 12.5 thousand mining speed, which is pretty cool. And then for the neon spore light shiny, it's 68.8 thousand mining power, 62.5 thousand coin multiplier, 7.75 thousand speed, and 6.12 thousand crystals. So if we equip my best, oh wait, wait, what? Wait, oh, we have better pets. So you're telling me that this pet right here is better than this? Wait, it definitely is. Okay, I probably should have done that instead of like using a bunch of neon spore lights. But I guess we could just do something with those later. Wait. Oh wow, wow. Okay, that's pretty cool. But I guess that's it. I mean, we have a pretty powerful team. So let's go ahead and collect that chest from Mr. Cavern, and let's see how much we get. Let's see. We got a trill, not even a trillion. I see. Yeah, we did get a trillion. I, I don't know what I'm saying. We did get a trillion. Let's see how much we get if I sell. Ooh, six trillion without boost. Cause when I usually sell, I have those uh those coin boost on, and I do sell with that on because it gives me a lot more currency, and I can grind a lot more often. But I guess that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, I went ahead and hatched a hundred thousand of the pastel leg, and I got a whole bunch of those good those good pets that I can use for mining and currency and all. But if you guys enjoyed this video, then make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and turn notification bell on to post a brand new video. But anyways, guys, peace.